recording. We got, we got audio. Excellent. Woo! Welcome, everyone, Welcome. to session 39 of Fate. Friday Adventures, Total Excitement. You know, what we haven't done in a long time is introduce your characters. Wow. Well, because uh, they're about to be non Just because it's like... <laughs> We're just so Very used to everybody, thing. like who you are and everything. But to those of you new to the stream, Woo! welcome, by the way. You're uh, awesome. And we're going to kind of go around and just introduce your character. If you want to say your own name, that's cool. That's whatever. Uh, race, class. That's all we really need, unless you have more you want to talk about. We'll start with... Our page, our, our group, by the way, just to let you know, our post on the D&D &D group <coughs> on Facebook got approved right away this time. Cool. Thanks. Rad. Thank you to them. All right, uh, I'm Imsh. I'm a half orc, half man, half bear, barbarian, <laughs> and I uh, got a flaming eagle sonic sword. Pushy smasher. Pushy smasher. Pushy smasher. That's what? that's me. You know, I do what Did I you do. Cut yourself. Oh no, I'm eating chips. Oh, so. Anyway. Oh yeah, okay. Cut yourself on chips. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Salt and vinegar chips, so it's, it's even worse. That is even worse. <laughs> That's yeah. horrible. I've, uh, I'm yeah. uh, Evander Jadar. I was a dru uh, druid, and then something happened. Now I'm a gunslinger, so, and I'm he human. He woke up one day. So I woke up I was like, guns. oh! <laughs> but actually, I think it was like some kind of... Um, what happened was uh, Nagri, when he That's what it was. went to the Vale area, like the Vale Plain, um, broke the world. The like <laughs> there was a, a flash of, of our tech and you were kind of caught in it and you changed and became guns because retcon. <laughs> that's why. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> because at that point we had been in the game long enough that you're like, I don't drew it very well. Yeah. So can I be something else? And yeah. I'm like, sure. We'll figure out a way to do that in game. And so we did. And let me tell you, you were a much better gunslinger than you ever were a druid. So. <laughs> it's true. No, dude, this spells. I can't get them down. I, like, the so spear. much better. <laughs> it's holy it's crap. It's personal at all. No. But, but Terrell. It is the truth. Yeah, that druid, man. Terrell is the uh, class. away for a moment. I don't know what he's doing. I'm Maybe posting he's, shit. he's posting shit. That's cool. Um, I'll go ahead and talk hey, about him. I am Terrell <laughs> Nazgoth. I'm a Matthew Mercer character, Blood Hunter. Awesome, and uh, yeah, I was trapped in S Strahd's world for like 300 years or 400 years, something like that. I'm a human, but in Strahd's right. world, we, we have done the curse of Strahd, by the way, for those of you. Who yeah, know. yeah, uh, I was trapped in Strahd's see, world. And, see uh, the YouTube stuff. Um, linked on the page. It's actually, I believe, on my page. The Strahd stuff is. Yeah, it was before we got the like, streaming official IoT. Some of the shot stuffs on the IoT. Okay, page. right. <clears throat> it's kind of crossed over. Thanks to Ulfgar, my uh, well, not thanks to Ulfgar, my leg was fucking ripped off. <laughs> thanks to Imch. Yeah, thanks, thanks to, to Imch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but so you have a thanks stone to Ulfgar, your love. <laughs> he successfully <laughs> but did he die? divine mentioned me a stone leg, which is and rad. with the blood hunterness, I can get thunder thighs. Thunder thighs. Thunder, <laughs> thunder thigh. <laughs> Thunder thighs. Yes. That's under thighs. And that's yeah. hilarious. Yeah. Yep. Uh, that's me. Missing at the moment, he'll be here relatively soon, is uh, Eisen Schmidt, the Death Elf Bard. <laughs> yes. Uh, who, by the way, has a stupid persuasion skill. Well, yeah, well, he's like, a bard. Holy shit. He's it's a bard. frustrating because he's a bard. how high his persuasion skill is for me as the DM. But that's irrelevant. Sigh. Well, yeah. As mentioned, I'm I'm Sai Sai Nailo 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 Nailo. It's got like a little dot. Got like a little dot the eye. The umlaut. Yeah. So I pronounce it funny. Uh, my wood elf, multi class, um, mostly ranger. Ten levels in ranger, then three levels in rogue, just to get enough to have the assassin assassin archetypeness. So it'll, it now allows me to, anytime I get, so like I'm higher on initiative list and I get to attack someone before they move. Fucking automa automatic crit. Indeed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it needs to happen. And I'm playing Ulfgar Frostbeard, the Dwarven War Cleric. Um, he's, uh, he's a irascible old asshole. Mm-hmm. 
and um, makes bad decisions. Yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> point of note. Uh, this is the third section in a row that one of our characters has decided just not to show up. So, I kind of expected that, but... Uh, now it's official? Three in a row means you're out. Uh, because oh, you oh. are too flaky to maintain. That's okay. It happens. And not everyone's super into this like we are. Um, we we so, are the coolest people. Yeah, <laughs> Nagri, That's so cool. Nagri is now officially a bad guy. A bad guy as far as the current timeline. We'll kind of we'll get into what happens to him if you do other things to, to change. <laughs> Can we save this time on this a little bit? Just to go kill us. <laughs> just as long as you kill us. Because he has that hat I want. <laughs> <laughs> the hat of disguise? Yeah, no. I want that wow. right now. Wow, that's <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> so I'm going to right. take it. Not, uh, okay, so here's what happened. It was, it's time to do some recap. Uh, I'm sure all of you can remember this fairly vividly. <laughs> As a uh, no one is paying attention to us right now. There's a cat. I know. The there's a cat <laughs> fighting himself. You can't see him. That's, that's <laughs> how we really get the viewers. That, that's fine. Cat cool. cam oh, cat cam. Cool. Cat cam. Cat cam is key. Who does not like cat cam? Little He's looking at himself. <laughs> He's like, whoa. <laughs> you were taken. That's me. You were taken to the realm of Santa of Claus. Of course he doesn't. And you mean Krampus? And Santa Claus was uh, bored and wanted to entertain his elf slaves. And uh, so you fought in his Tower of Doom. You fought through all of it. Ulfgar all 15 made levels. the Those first 15. bad decision of calling out Santa Claus. So he kind of showed up and fucked with you guys for a little bit. <laughs> and I believe then, the point was standing uh, a bitch or something mm. like that. No, no, no. I called the dragon a bitch and its master a bitch. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was channeling my yeah. inner Nagri. And then he showed up. <laughs> they fought. You did uh, actually quite a bit of, of damage to uh, Santa Claus. <laughs> and uh, he's like... That was entertaining. I had a great time. Have a wish and some sweet ass items, which we uh, showcased last session. Uh, see the YouTube when I get that posted in like two months from now because I'm really bad about that. Uh, we'll maybe someone will get on your ass about it. I I'll get to that later. Um, of important note is that Evander, as far as like of particularly important note, Evander got a deck of many things. Woo! We'll talk about that. In a little bit. Yeah, what? that happened. Anyway, I'm the, the wish was used, <laughs> and I quote, to it's gain three levels that will not go away in this place at this time. Yeah, that was the one word. And I was like, used. cool, because you were in a totally different plane, and Which so you gain is... three levels. You go, you come back to Sartek City. Sartek City is a ruin. And Kagan almost kills Ulfgar because because he doesn't know oh, yeah, who he Santa is. Too. That's right. You all have Santa beards as well. <laughs> I have a Santa L. beard now. Everybody does. Because <laughs> Santa was was like, yes, everyone gets Santa beards. <laughs> it's like uh, like straight Christmas or Santa which Claus. Which you're welcome to cut off. Or yeah, I mean, it's trying. not coming back. Uh, it's just it's there until you get rid of it. Essentially, yeah. so I would keep that. Um, <laughs> I wish mean, you look so fucking funny. So they are <laughs> the so. Like, Kagan. Kagan shows up. He's like, "Who do you serve?" You say, "Whoa, dude, chill the fuck. What the what the hell happened?" It's us, and man. And then he took you down to the sewers. That's still relatively safe. And you encountered a couple of individuals, and you had some talks. That you found out that it's forty years in the future from when you were. Tiamat's alive. The Terrasque is free because of all the deaths that happened. It made the barrier in the veil a little too strong sure. or too weak. I forgot about and, the Terrasque. Uh, it's free yeah. somewhere. We're kind of sidetracked. Not super relevant in this particular case. Um, a lot of bad things are happening right now. Clearly. Um, we have to go back. The, the <laughs> Dragon Cultist. I'm a sewer bear now. <laughs> the Underdark is actually now safer than, used to be. than surface. the surface because of all the dragons and such. And Terrasque. 
and yeah, other things All of terror horrible terrorness. Is, is my strength twenty nine now? Yes. Okay. So yeah, you have mine. It's twenty three. Woo! Yeah. So you got the epicest belt of strengthness. Yeah. Yeah, your strength higher which than mine. Gives your strength yeah, twenty, which makes your strength twenty nine. <laughs> it's stupid. It does obviously require attunement, so you kind of swap those out with a short rest. Now you're kind of still in the meeting with Kagan and Schmidty, the now forty years old uh, child of Eisenschmidt. When I saw you, you were a baby. Who is a member of Penumbra. <laughs> of course, he's a badass. Uh, a very high-level rogue at this point. He's a dark elf, of course. Who'd that tell? So, the son of You're still Eisen kind of Schmidt. sitting at this, like, war table. You better drink like a fucking champ. And, you know, you're having a chat with Kagan, and, and he's, you know... There are some other things... <laughs> there are other things that you need to know. Before you go anywhere, this is vitally important. <laughs> and he kind of motions, and they bring out for each of you this decanter of water, and it is uh, blessed. It's all blessed. It's it's a decanter of endless holy water. Nice. So, you know, obviously, you're probably. Interested in why we have is the these? Fire yeah. giant? Is there why we've been having these crafted? Demon shits everywhere. Is that fire giant? I think so. Sort of. Not really. There. I mean, there are demons. Actually, we have some demons that are helping us because of course they don't. Nobody likes Tiamat. Yeah. <laughs> fuck Tiamat and all his her stupid face. <laughs> anyway, fuck Tiamat. All her stupid faces. Not relevant. <clears throat> Here's the problem. Technos of the realm has been tainted by. Tiamat and all of what is going on. What that means is if you die, the Technos will take over your body. You need to be anointed with this holy water as soon as possible. About, you know, less than a minute, the tainted Technos infuses into your body and you arise as an undead nice. slave. Slave and we don't want an undead uh, imp. Powered, still kill powered all of us. by. We go swag with Sticky Sapuku. Powered, supposed powered by Tiamat or controlled by Tiamat. Yeah. Not good. Now, resurrection can be done, but you can't. It's not in the conventional way that it was before. Uh, you have to use. You have to present something for trade, a magic item. Uh, of rare or rarer quality, uh, because essentially all of the surrounding technos is not is tainted. It's tainted, so it can be purified, uh, but that takes a while. People don't have the time for that. <clears throat> yes, you can, of course. So that's why we have a uh, a series of wizards and other casters who are constantly working to refine Technos. Um, the fact that you have, and like, Kagan is very interested in the fact that like, those of you who are casters have the like containers of Artec that you use to cast your spells. Wait a second. Purify. There's, uh, there are no casters. There's no casters think. in our group anymore. Not really, so, right. Well, we've got a bard. bard we're That's not. Bard. The well, bard would, would 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 have one, yeah. And that's it. So ours is pure. Well, yeah. His still, is. you're yeah, because you haven't been. It 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 just hasn't been anywhere. Like they have a few containers of purified technos that are just like super sealed up and everything. Yeah. Um. But it's used sparingly. Yeah. Elric, who I mentioned last time was missing. I'm going to retcon that because he's going to be in the picture somewhere. He's an enchanter at this point. He has been mass producing Dragon Slayer weapons. So you pretty much made him an artificer. Essentially, yeah. Cool. He's been um, crafting Dragon Slayer weapons of all kinds yep. that do bonus damage to dragons because. That is the Oops. primary problem. Hey, Bob. Hmm? Okay. If we end up staying yeah, go, here, can you can pick up a second one. Mm -hmm. Now, <laughs> you're the big of a second one. 
gentlemen. Why not? Yes. Big house. Big house. Big house. Big house. Yeah, you're Standard. right. Might you were well told to. by Kagan yeah, I think I that <laughs> what needs to happen, knowing that you're from the past, of course, mm -hmm. is that Sven needs to be saved. Now, over the past 40 years, they were able to find <clears throat> all of the pieces of the Pearl of Abbott. It is a complete sphere now. That was our job. Oh, no, that's Chaos's job. That's what I mean by our job. Yeah. Uh, we, we just fell apart. Uh, you're in fate right now? Well, <laughs> so, <laughs> no, like, like, yeah. you guys already have four or five pieces of the seven. Yeah, I know. We're, we're, like, we're going to close. find them all. Mm -hmm. But here's oh, the thing. It, it, it we was, don't know. You all succeeded. Yeah. We don't I, really yeah. know exactly what it does. We, It's been together for a little while. Uh, we keep it sealed in a box. Um, it's really shiny and fancy. That is, no, it's a different box to this one. <laughs> 40 years <laughs> later. Yeah. She says uh, my but it's secure. But it, it <laughs> is, it's, it's essentially a box of non-detection. So that it cannot be found through through scrying means or anything like that. No one's Plus, it's, it can't call out to any of the uh, angelic, like, powerful beings that may be after it. Evil or good or otherwise. Wouldn't, what uh, we're fairly certain, though, is that it has something to do with Sven. Somehow. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> he himself. Alright. Incarnate. If you're her. going after... That's right on us. If you're going after Sven, and I really... That's know, what we have to do. If at all possible, I think that that is the best plan. Um, you want to take this with you. What is this? The, the pearl. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, sealed chest. up. The chest. The, the chest, chest that has the pearl in it, yeah. Um, should we put it in a bag of holding, or should no. we, one of us hold it? No, no God, don't. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. We've already messed up reality enough as it is. The yeah. chest is an extra dimensional space. So Part of how it's non-detection, because yeah. it's, it's extra not mental. technically on All the right. same plane. Um... Don't, yeah, that's key. So, Please don't do that. <laughs> Very uh, bad things. Evander or Eisenschmidt should hold on to it because you'll be at the back of the line. Mm -hmm. Um, he, Eisenschmidt's really good at not getting hit. So. Yeah, so give it to Eisenschmidt. Yeah. He'll strap it up on his pack. Yep. That we never so, talked so, about. So Owl bear. So, should one of us try and like, the, secure it to him without his knowledge so he doesn't even know he has it? He's not here. No, he, he's going to know he has the Pearl of Heaven. He has a, we're putting a fancy fucking box on him. He's, he's going to be like, what the fuck is it. this? Yeah. He'll try to open it, so we should... Yeah, no, we'll tell him, no, it's Pearl of Heaven. Don't fucking open it. He's like, hmm? Uh, owl bear. Are you talking about the... Barrel. Oh, yeah. To the Are you talking about the char the character or the uh, the piece out there? Because that's this is the bear. That's just Imch. Yeah. I'm asked who that was. <laughs> The bear? The bear. I'm, I'm the bear. That's me. Yes. Imps is a werebear barbarian. I'm a burr. Burr. Half orc, werebear, barbarian. Yeah, that was way early. Yeah. Chat um, and that was when the Brokenness began. That's, that's when the game We broke. actually have an owl bear as well. That's as like a started. summon. Oh, that's what I was basically uh, a meat shield. Yeah, he's just a meat shield. Like two hits now. At this point, yeah, because owl bears are like not very he's strong. It's literally just a distraction. Huh! I choose you. Ah. <laughs> like, no, no, stop that. Stop. <clears throat> what the thing you're doing? Do you? This is Kagan speaking. Okay. Do you have anything that can help us? Like. Yeah. In any sort of immediate we, format. I'm gonna, I want to roll an intelligence. Did we see Santa give yeah. Evan the, the deck? Yes. So I'm gonna roll an intelligence check because I know I'm shitty at intelligence, but why the hell not? Give me, give me that intelligence check. Actually, anybody that would like to can make one. Yeah, I like to know what I have too. So well, I know what I have. Oh, that's a no. That that's is a, a thirteen. That's a four. Terrell, beat me. You want to give it a shot? Yeah, with my plus zero. I, I will allow Arcana if you're trained in it. Okay, that's better. 
But I'm not. It's still no. I'm not trained in it. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, yes, I know what it is. That's a that's a that's a twenty four. Okay. No. Five in a row. You just roll, Eight, nine, roll back. Nine. Okay. <laughs> just tell me what to do. If she's not built for any intelligence based rolls, no. so that's fine. I totally get it. Plus, I don't think he would care to. Even yeah, me either. It. No intelligence. Twenty four. Uh, you have heard of the deck of many things before, and know that it is an obscenely powerful and dangerous magic item set, I guess. Um, you know some of what it can do, not everything, of course. I've heard some, I've heard some things. You've heard some I've things. I've been around for a long time. Yeah. You've heard some things. So, I look over and I wonder, uh, t take out that thing that Claus gave us. Bring it out. And it's still like wrapped up and everything. Looks okay. Like it's pouch. Okay. Looks like, I look at Kagan. Uh, this. <laughs> look at some playing cards. As far as I'm aware. This will put you. Would you like hand it to him? No, no. Hold yeah. it out. I hold it out. Do not let it go. This, as far as I'm aware, is the uh, deck of many things, at least partially. Let's go wide. Uh, have you heard of it? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. How? So, look at the and I'm sitting there just stroking my beard. Look at the beard. Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> look at Santa Claus. Of course. You met the guy? I, I have a, that guy interferes so much. At this point, I so to much. shave off my beard. You could be doing that like, like while, that's, yeah, while that's you're what, You have yeah. daggers and swords. For, yeah, should I roll for that? Or, to no, you can shave your face. Shave your face. You don't have to roll to shave your face. Oh, that's right. He's not for best shaving. That's hilarious. All right, roll it. Roll it. Please roll a one. <laughs> Dexterity check, right? Yeah, what that you're what, not what, proficient what, 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 in. Roll a d20. Give me a. Uh, it's just straight dexterity. So yeah, dexterity. Okay. I mean, it's because all... you are not proficient in, save, in, in shaving your face because you've never had to do it before. <laughs> so I don't get my proficient proficiency bonus. Just do my straight dex. Just score. straight dex. All right. Well, Please just... roll a one. <laughs> Cut your jugular. Oh. That is an eight. <laughs> eight total? Uh, no, 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 eight plus six. Six. That's so fourteen. Yeah, you nick yourself. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So here? like, so like, you're, I go somewhere while while they're like, like in the <laughs> war like room. You're like, and... I got. You, you just start. I, I can't. You just I start can't. like shaving your face. You get a, a couple of nicks here and there. It's like. Um, like I come back with like just like little you, you like torn pieces of toilet paper, just like. <laughs> you didn't use them. You didn't specify Jackson using mirrors. So I'm, I'm assuming you've left a Hitler stash. <laughs> <laughs> a white Hitler stash. <laughs> That's doubtful. <laughs> I probably no. <Nah. coughs> you you shave your face. You nick yourself a few times. Um, <laughs> we'll say that you take like one point of damage. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, All right. I can, I can handle that. Ah, oh, God! Dang it! So, the deck of many things, Santa Claus. We've not opened it yet, but there may be something in there that could help us or make everything worse. You've, uh, I'm familiar with the deck of many things, yes. Um, Probably more than I am. My group found it once. Same one. Oh, lovely. One of ours, uh... <laughs> <laughs> kind of disappeared after he drew his card. So. Yeah. Oh, that, that's great! Now we know it's not in here. Yeah. That, that's we don't know the cards are in there. Yeah, rude. Fucking rude, man. We, we don't know what cards are in there in the first place. So yeah. doesn't matter. We don't know that the, there's only one of those cards. No, we, well, he knows all about it. He knows there that once the card is gone, just, it's gone. You, you know some about it, not a uh, lot. Um, we have researched extensively <laughs> for it. Um, Santa had it. There's a card in there that could help us immediately fix it. Now, again, a lot of bad. There's a lot of bad. It's a high risk. If you wish to draw, you can. Kagan will. Oh, Kurt's gonna go pray in the corner for a second. See if this <laughs> is a good idea. You're gonna use a use the thing. I'm gonna use the thing. Can we? That's my Grim Psychometry idea. wouldn't help at all. That mm -hmm. just tells us about what, what, it. What no, my Grim psych psych Psychometry. I can tell us about the deck, but I wouldn't be able idea. to help us. A <laughs> god call? Uh, is that right? Autumn says you should voice <laughs> Fable 4. <laughs> Autumn says you should <laughs> voice <laughs> Fable 4. <laughs> like you, do, you should be a voice actor. <laughs> I would love to be a voice actor. Yeah. Thank but, you. Yeah. <laughs> fable 4, that'd be, that'd yeah. be awesome. If only. For reals. Rest in peace, Lionhead Studios. No shit. 
so Especially good. Under a 16 should, now. Should have made their You're doing divine intervention. Final boss. I mean, that's the only thing I can think like of. Game game okay. Boss. No, no. Boss. That's, that's what's the only. What's what's the only what's isn't there that like that like spell you have that lets you ask the question? Yeah. They don't want. I pretty much like. Hey, I had no problem. with That would tell me if the next 30 seconds are going to be really, really bad. So, let's conclude this one. Are we done? And yep. yes. All right. I love Fable One, though. Yeah. yeah. I love Fable One. Yeah. I really enjoyed 